Hey, it's Rory here, and welcome to another episode of Rotato. In this episode, I'm going to be trying to get as much armor as possible and see how how little damage these enemies can do to me. I'm going to get to the point where I hope that every single enemy deals like one damage or less to me. That's what I'm hoping to get to. And if I do, then that's great. And welcome to the video. This is Brotato, a roguelike arena, Bullet Heaven. And if you've never seen it before, then I, I highly consider looking it up, playing it, and hitting the like button. Hit the like button if you like roguelites or roguelites. I would appreciate that greatly. Okay. If you don't know what this mod is, this is Sif's Rainbow Chest mod. And in this mod, you're able to pick. You get these rainbow chests instead of normal crates. And with those chests, you're able to pick any item in the game that you'd like. So I'm going to be gearing my build towards as much, well, as much shield as possible. So I'm going to need a few more trees because trees have the highest chance of spawning them, so I need a bunch of trees. Okay. Take some armor, take some dodge, sure. Okay. Not doing the best so far. Need a little more armor, come on. The good thing is this weapon deals more darn damage per armor I have, so once I start start getting the armor to massive numbers, this will start doing so much more damage. I just have to make sure not to die, because if I die, well, everything's over. Okay. For one, I definitely need the Lumberjack shirt. I'll take that. I'll take... What was I going to take? I'll take, I'll take more trees, why not? Okay, more luck. Sure, some attack speed. Take some more armor. And hopefully I don't die here. I have 44% armor. That's bound to reduce my damage by quite a lot. Okay. Okay, my damage is pretty high. 29 which is not bad at all for these enemies. I'm also doing danger 5, because with a broken run like this, what's the point of doing danger 0? Makes it a little little more of a challenge. Even though it's pretty clear that it won't stay a challenge once I get overpowered, but that's a lot of crates. Okay, I'm going to be finding out what's the best for armor. Go all the way down. I'll take this just because. Okay. None of those give armor. None of those give armor either. Okay, this one gives five armor, but is that worth it? I'm not too sure. Let's keep looking though. Yeah, it looks like that's the best option I have. Yeah. That's okay. How much armor do I have? 37. Okay. 71 less damage, I'll take it. I'll take some luck. And Yep, luck. Another spiky shield. More armor. Okay. If you have noticed, uh, the shop is a little scaled towards me. That's also an option you can toggle. 25% of all items that spawn in the, ch in the shop will be geared towards me this character specifically. So a bunch of armor things will be there, which is very helpful. If you notice the absurd amount of trees, that's also because of another thing I can control in Sif's chest mod, which is like a 30 times tree multiplier. And the enemies are also multiplied by two, just because I thought, why not do that? It would be very helpful. Go all the way down here. There we go. 
91. Not bad. More melee damage. More armor. Only issue is I have like no regen at all. So I'm gonna have to go with just a bunch of attack speed. I mean, not attack speed, sorry, health. So much health to the point where I can't die even if I can't regenerate health. I just won't be able to die. Maybe I should go for the warrior, warrior health instead of the exoskeleton. Maybe I will do that. Because the armor helmet also gives me health on top of armor, so it's always good. Okay, the damage I'm doing with a 75% crit chance, that's a lot of damage. And because of this modifier, it might be a little higher than 75. Some weapons have modifiers that just give them damage that's higher than it shows. I mean, crit chance is a little higher than it shows just because, I guess. Okay. Dealing with things pretty easily. Not dead. It's the most important part. Get wave complete. You know what that means. Just go here and just do that. Crit chance. Regen. Take you. I'll take you. Take you. I'll take you. Take you. This, this, and this. Take this. 147 armor. 91 less damage. Is that the cap? It might be the cap. If it if it does, if that is at the actual cap, then I'll just have to, well, end the run when I get to the cap, because what's the point of getting more shield? You know? The run basically is over once I figured out how much sh maximum defense I could reduce. But yeah, the episode's basically over. If that is the case, I'm not sure it's the case though. I'm also gonna bump the enemy spawn to fifty per fifty percent fifty times, just because I feel like there's not enough enemies here. There's just not enough. Okay, more armor. Yeah, it looks like... Oh, no, actually. It is going up. Now that's his 92 less armor. Hmm. Maybe there's hope after all. We'll just have to see, though. can barely move now and everything does one damage so there's no way I can die and if I do die well it'll be quite the spectacle because well that's the whole point well that's the point now it was dying because there's just no way I can die because everything does like one damage so there's literally like no way for me to die at all and I do believe once it gets to like a hundred percent damage instead of giving me zero damage done, it's probably gonna give me like one just because of how the shop worked. I got a hundred percent shop discount, but it only that price was always one. So I kinda feel like it's gonna be the same thing for this, so and the game is already lagging, so thank you for watching. If you enjoyed please hit the subscribe button, like button. Thank you for watching.